what a crazy morning. So I just got back from, excuse me, my OBG appointment, which was already like in my pregnancy diary. So you guys already saw like the blood drawing and stuff and how embarrassing that was. Now we're in, um, we're in Nashua at the moment, actually. We're eating at a new place called Martha's Exchange or something. What's the matter? But we're gonna try this place uh, and see how we like it. He's standing out in the rain though. What's the matter? What's the matter? Well, I fucked it up and I put it all in the wrong spot. <laughs> how do you put- I extended this person's time longer. <laughs> We don't use pay meters very often. <laughs> oh my goodness gracious. Anyways, yeah, my morning has just been kind of all over the place, but I'm starving. I got so sick at the OBGYN that I don't have anything in my stomach anymore. Don't I need a thing? No, it's this meter that they call it these two spots, left side, right side. Okay. Hi. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> okay. Stop, 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 it's raining. Tea. Oh, it smells like a. Is it a chocolate? <gasps> God. You know I'm coming back for this, right? This place is really nice. Like, really nice. Even look at the sink. It's so pretty. Okay, I'll be right out. people nobody knocks on public restroom doors anymore look services <laughs> organic airbrush tan we have teeth whitening so we're starting we're gonna try the where was it spinach and artichoke dip in a bread bowl and then i think for my appetizer i'm doing they have like a mac and cheese section i'm gonna try the pulled pork one what are you thinking i get like three meals i'm not sure <laughs> <laughs> well, spinach and artichoke dip. At the end of the day, uh, what was it? Where we go? He's talking about not your average Joe's. I think I vlogged with you guys there. Maybe it was very average. It was. <laughs> I think I, um, maybe like a month ago. I've been there like three times um, in the past like, two months. But I think I went at the beginning of October. And, and I actually had a really good experience there. But I got like a pulled pork sandwich and then I went there two more times, one with Ella, which it wasn't good. I didn't like what I got at all. And then I went with him and uh, was Ella there again? Yeah, she was. I went there with him and Ella again and it wasn't, I got like a meatloaf this time. You got like a brunch, like a Sunday brunch though. Yeah. The, he got like what, the French, French toast, toast? Which was not your traditional french toast and they definitely baked it in the oven which made it very dry it had like a very crunchy like you could tell the crust was very overcooked yes <laughs> and then i had an eggs benedict which they didn't Did have in good. the menu well oh, i also it? custom made mine i looked at their options and i was like well nothing looks good well wasn't it like on a english muffin yep. and then spinach because they had like yeah. a vegetarian so i got one with spinach uh, barbecue chicken Hollandaise uh, chipotle aioli. I drizzled it. I was gonna step it up and get some guacamole, but Extensions. I didn't want to freak them out. <laughs> this isn't on our menu. Overload. <laughs> but I mean, was that the? Well, which did you prefer, the Benny over the French toast? Oh, the Benny hands down. And the problem is the home fries was. Oh yeah. I basically got served a brick of salt <laughs> with yeah. a couple of shaves of potato. The Bennies were uh, served with home fries, and he even he's like they're too salty, and I'm like. No, so I tried one and it was, it was we're both salt fans and it was like I love salt. I grossed yeah. people with the salt I use. It was bad, like bad, but mouthful of salt. Yeah, so we're gonna give this place a try today. Um, 
Thank you. Excellent. Thank you. It's beautiful on the inside, but I want to see how the food is. Just like you, honey. I'm ugly yeah. on the inside. <laughs> I'll let you guys know how it goes. But we're a little confused. <laughs> yeah, it looks great. I want a chip. Yeah, they brought like, carrots and celery. Um, I mean, obviously you can use the bread to eat it, but I don't know. We're still uh, near kind of where we ate earlier, but my sister-in-law gave birth today to my nephew. Um, so we visit her, visited her earlier. Um, you know, I'm not gonna vlog in there, give her her privacy. But uh, we picked up Ella from school. We went home for a little while. I had to buy her a new lunchbox because hers broke. And now we're back um, for some visiting hours. So that's pretty much what we're doing for the rest of the night. <laughs> What's that? Come on camera. Me tripping over my cat. That'd be so funny. Okay, things have been a little bit crazy. So yesterday, my mom, Amber, and I ended up doing quite a bit of shopping. Um, we went to Burlington Coat Factory because today, <laughs> today is my cousin's baby shower. He's having a little girl. We might have gone overboard. <laughs> I have two little gift baskets here I'm going to use, but I figured I would show you guys what we got her. Real quick, I can show you. I picked up Ella a couple of things because she, I know it's like super overexposed, but um, she outgrew her old bathrobe, so I got her a new bathrobe, a little winter dress that she can wear to school, and then she got a new pair of fleece pajamas. Yeah, this natural light. Okay, there we go. <laughs> a new pair of fleece pajamas as well. Um, because it's getting cold outside. It's getting real cold. Um, she did pick out her Christmas dress. And she picked out a Thanksgiving dress. I know a while ago in a couple of vlogs, maybe I didn't, I don't even know if I ended up showing you guys, but we got her like this cute little sweater dress for Thanksgiving, but I found like a Thanksgiving dress. So she's gonna wear that instead. So she's actually gonna wear that little sweater dress later today. I gotta get her dressed super soon because I gotta go pick up my mom and Amber. Um, we're just gonna carpool. So yesterday when Amber and I were looking at all the baby stuff, I'm like, instead of like, cause we we're looking at the same stuff. I said, why don't we just do one big, like one big present? You know what I mean? Just split it between the two of us. So she agreed. We went overboard again, <laughs> but we've got a bunch of cute stuff. This is coming unfolded a little bit, but this is like a little, I don't know. I think I need to, because I don't want her to see the prices. <laughs> so I think I'm going to just kind of scratch it out as I go. Um, <laughs> but she has this little like hooded unicorn. Um, oh my gosh, like a, a towel kind of thing or a robe. I know my channel has been just like full of baby stuff, but there are a lot of babies coming. This baby's getting obnoxious. <laughs> um, and then we got her this little baby blanket. Sorry, adjusting you guys with a little um, elephant plushie on there. Oh, gotta get that price off. When I come home today, I have so much to do. I'm just like, while I'm going through this stuff, <laughs> I'm panicking a little bit. <laughs> Look at Arrow. <laughs> He's going in the bag. <laughs> Ooh, Ella's playing with some Play-Doh at the moment. Where's Arrow? <laughs> Hi, bud. Do you like the bag? <laughs> Now leave him there, leave him there. I don't want to pick him up and hurt him, but I'm just... No, him. Yeah, because he's toppling to one side. <laughs> he likes the bag. We had three bags full of stuff, guys. Oh my gosh. Oh, look this at this. <laughs> yeah, I'm actually packing Lily's stuff up right now. This household is <laughs> chaos. Um, I know, and then the bag. Yeah, you're going to break the bag, girlfriend. And we got like a bunch of accessories too, but... Um, I personally picked her out this set of onesies. She's going to be born in, be careful you don't fall out. She's going to be born in February when there's not like a whole lot of like holidays going on. But um, I picked her out some of these. I'm just panicking a little because I'm like, I'm running out of time a little bit, but we'll be fine. I just got to get her dressed and brush her hair and then we're pretty much good to go. Um, and then, oh, this was super cute. <laughs> and brush your teeth. Yeah. This is super cute, this owl set. <laughs> it's just like, I don't know, it's a little nostalgic to me because this is all stuff like I would have bought Ella, you know what I mean? 
Um, but now I'm buying for a little boy, which is a whole new adventure. So that's really exciting. Oh my gosh. I thought two bags might be enough, but we'll see. I may put the accessories in that smaller bag. We'll see. And then we got her a little, <laughs> little pair of kitty pajamas. And she has this set of onesies again, but these are like short sleeve onesies. Super adorable. I haven't even had an opportunity. Like I've been wanting to set up my high chair and everything. And I just, I haven't had time to breathe. We just bought a new pellet stove the other day. So moving that in was a hassle. I'm just kind of talking as I'm showing you guys stuff here because I'm running out of time. Um, but yeah, we had to get that pellet stove in and all the pellets and stuff, picking it up. Um, I, I just feel like my head is spinning and then we're doing like there's gonna be like a festival of trees at Ella's school So we bought like a tree. I'll show you guys that later probably today because we'll work on it. Um, she also has a set of Bibs. I love the colors. They're like maroon and pink. Um, I love that combination together. I'm running out of space So I think I'm gonna start filling up this smaller bag with the smaller items because we also have this other hooded towel but it's like a penguin instead. I asked her, cause she was running out to Walmart yesterday, Amber, I asked if she could pick up a card <laughs> and uh, some tissue paper. Cause I'm like, I have the bags, but I don't have any tissue paper. And she was running out to Walmart anyway. Um, then I also got her, these were my personal favorite bottles with Ella. And these are the bottles I'll be buying Hunter as well. But they're the Avent ones. They're the Avent ones, but we just got her like the small ones. It's like basically, newborn all the way up till I don't know when they start drinking more formula and then of course we got her some little pacifiers with a little pacifier clip Ooh, sneaky we got her some mittens which I've explained before um that they're really really helpful especially for newborns not to scratch their face some more bibs because trust me you're gonna go through bibs like water <laughs> and the cool thing is everything's super affordable it obviously adds up quickly but uh, you can get a lot. Um, I got her a pair of socks. I should probably fill, pick somewhere else to film, but this is a really convenient spot. Oh, we have some teethers as well, which, ooh, packaging is getting slightly open. I think that happened when we were um, just transporting everything. And then the last thing I think, I think, <laughs> is just this big um, unicorn plushie. And Ella actually picked it out for her. So I'm gonna stick that right in the big bag. So good, we got these two. <laughs> oh my God, I think we were a little, little crazy. <laughs> got these two big bags. Um, again, she'll have the card and tissue paper when I go pick her up, but I gotta go get Miss Ella changed. Oh, one last thing, really random, but my mom's birthday is coming up and she saw these and she's like, you know like those little things in life that you just like really, really enjoy. But the last thing I got, um, I was saying that like, for me, it's mugs. I love collecting mugs. Like, it's just like a little fun thing for me to do. Um, with my mom, she loves pretty pens. <laughs> like she loves writing in pretty pens. So she was looking at these at checkout and I know my mom, she's very frugal and she won't buy anything that she like doesn't really need. So she was eyeballing and saying how much she loved them and then she was gonna go put them back. And I grabbed them for her and threw them in my car. <laughs> I was like, mom, no arguing. Your birthday is coming up. <laughs> I'll just get them for you. So um, I'm gonna throw these up on top of the bag just so I can remember to bring them to her. I'm like out of breath. All right, let's go get Ella dressed. Oh my God, just when I thought I was done, <laughs> I went to go throw these bags away and I realized there's more stuff. Holy crap. Um, not much though. I've officially given up on filming <laughs> this spot. We got her a little pack of... What is going on? Little hats. We got her a couple little like baby toys. So we got her this turtle. We got her, I think this is Clarice from Rudolph. This is super cute. Oh, and then the last thing, which was actually on my baby registry too, is this little like fresh fruit feeder thing. Um, so I thought that was cool. Okay, that should be it. I've shown this before. I apologize. I just really don't think I have. But this was her original Thanksgiving dress. So we're going to have her wear this today. <laughs> I got this at the children's place. Um, and then she has little gold tights because this has like gold sparkle on it. And then a little... Oh, <laughs> he's saying hi to Hunter. You're sweet. You're going to be a good big sister, aren't you? Mm -hmm. 
Okay, so we're gonna wear this today. Yeah, we can wear the little kitty ears. Yeah, you can wear the kitty ears if you want to. All right, girl, let's get dressed. I just have to say something real quick. We're finishing getting dressed. Ella's putting some of her earrings back. But we've always had an issue with Ella changing her earrings. She's always been super afraid of it. But today, she was super duper brave. When you're done, baby, come here. I'm gonna get her shoes ready too. Here, let me put it in your um, headband first so we can see. Come here. All right, go show our friend. <gasps> Let's see. Oh, we changed our earrings today, so they match. What, what kind of ice cream earrings do you have in? Chocolate chip. The minty chocolate chip is all right. One of your favorite ice creams. Oh, I'm so proud of her. She was so nervous. And then baby did it. Oh, I love you. Ah! <laughs> Squish at me. Ah! What kind of shoes we got? We got these little wedgie, wedgie shoes again today. I take a seat. Decided just for fun to pair my green dress with these purple heels today, but I'm gonna go start the car. Ella looks beautiful. I still gotta brush her hair, but she looks beautiful eating an Oreo. <laughs> that we brought home. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, I just basically wanted to show you guys a little bit of like the decorations and stuff. It was so beautifully decorated. It was super cute. Um, we had a good time though. <laughs> um, they ended up playing like this balloon game which was hilarious. I don't know if I'll get demonetized for like explaining the game or something but it was so funny. Um, so they played a little game. They played like the baby game where you have like the little necklace and you can't say the word baby. I lost mine. <laughs> that's because I call her baby. So I, I called her her nickname and somebody caught me. So I didn't, I didn't have any <laughs> necklaces by the end of the night, but I'm pooped. A, a couple people, a couple of my family members who had, um, wasn't able to attend my baby shower earlier. Um, ended up coming and like bringing me what they had for gifts. So I have a couple little cute things to show you guys when you get when we get home. But I am like so. Mommy, can you show our little deer? Um, yeah, I can show you Ella. <laughs> so the theme was like woodland fairy almost. Excuse me, but they had like little tiny baby deer. What is going on in my can body? Can we show the baby deers? Yep, when we get home, honey. Um, they had like little tiny baby deers on the center faces and it was like Ella's mission to collect them all. <laughs> so we have like five or six deer in one of the gift bags as well. It's actually so. five. Five? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> so, um, I'll show you guys those when we get home too, but I am trying to like get home because my headlight blew out. <laughs> <laughs> this stupid thing blew out um, and it's like just now getting dark. I don't know if you guys can see outside. It's like it's starting to get a little bit dark, but it's going to get dark fast. Um, so I'm trying to get home so I don't have to turn on my headlights. <laughs> so I don't have to turn on my headlights. TJ is going to help me, have to help me um, fix that. So when we get home and get like settled in, I know my cat's going to want food. So <laughs> it'll take me a few minutes, but I'll kind of um, show you guys everything. And I think I really want to set up hunter's um high chair as well um so is mine and, well no you don't need a high chair anymore sweetie hunter will um Why? but we have ella's old high chair too so i might try to throw that on the marketplace because it's still good um but yeah we'll, we'll see when we get home what what i decide to do before i even get into 
showing you guys the stuff that we brought home. It's actually like the perfect time of day where it's getting dark, but it's not like pitch dark. What the heck? Why would someone deliver it over here? <laughs> okay. I guess I have a package. I have a feeling I know that what this is, but well, I don't know what it is, but my aunt said to expect something. So I don't know why it, <laughs> these delivery people deliver in the most random spots. Anyways, I still have Christmas lights up from, <laughs> from last year. I don't like taking them down anymore. It's too much work. So basically I just want to plug them in real quick and see what still works. Excuse me while I, I gotta like trace the steps of these lights and find where I plugged them in. I'm pretty sure this part at least definitely is broken because of the weed whacker. I went over it a thousand times, uh, over it a thousand times. So I'm trying to see. Okay, and that's a new string. All right, so <laughs> basically what I learned is that most of my Christmas lights are junk. So unfortunately, yeah, I'm gonna have to pretty much replace everything out there. Wanted to make sure that I got around to showing you the little um, deer that we were talking about that she brought home. So she brought home one of pretty much every kind of deer she could find, but I promised I would show these on camera real quick. This one's cute. <laughs> so these were on like every centerpiece. And yes, she got permission to take these home, so, so don't worry. Okay, I'm making a trip Hi, to Walmart. <laughs> Slip back. Hi there, guys. <laughs> we're gonna go get some Christmas lights. <laughs> Tomorrow, we're gonna set up, I, I really wanna set up the high chair, but I need like a command hook to hold his bibs and stuff for us, so we're gonna get that too. I might do like a video on putting up the high chair and bouncer or something, I don't know. I did that with Ella's and it seemed pretty popular. You guys seem to like it. Um, those of you who were <laughs> with me five years ago, which is crazy. Um, but yeah, we're gonna head out and see what we can find. I just grabbed these, they work fine. Not my favorite, but <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right, Walmart trip was successful. I, oh, ow, 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 ow. I can't get in the small car. Hi, baby. Hi, baby. <laughs> um, Are you gonna kiss you, girl? Oh, no. <laughs> yeah. So we're gonna we're gonna stop at my mom's real quick and Me get what? the. Uh, well, Mimi ow. has the stuff that I got at Hobby Lobby the other day in in her garage, and then she has those two dresses I mentioned earlier. So I'm just gonna swing by tonight and grab them. Um, but I needed some stocking holders and I got gold ones. They're kind of hard to see. Um, we got some lights, which TJ okay. had, and then you saw me picking up some makeup wipes. So super quick, okay. quick trip. <laughs> I, I also tried looking for a stocking for Arrow. That's drama queen. I also tried looking for a stocking for Arrow. You're all right. <laughs> Um, oh. No luck though, so I'll keep my uh, eyes open for something for him. Yeah, Maybe something off of Amazon. Favorite time of year to buckle the children. Why? Let's buckle the children. 17 layers of clothes on. <laughs> ah. <laughs> not, easy, not hard at all. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm big and helpless. Yeah, so am I. <laughs> <laughs> I just don't have an excuse. Hi, babe. Ow. <laughs> Um, but I did buy the stocking, like, hooks, I think they're called. And then I got three, <laughs> I got three, yeah, can you hang those up for me? I got three stockings, um, from Hobby Lobby that match, like, I have fuzzy white stuff. <laughs> I gotta take off the tags, but I'll do that tomorrow. Here, can you put this one up? Good job, babe. Very cute. Wait, this is for us. Yeah. And then I have Ella's Christmas dress, which has this nice white fuzzy coat. Hold on, let me show them. Nice white fuzzy coat. It's all sparkly. She wanted this white one. And then behind it, we have a little Thanksgiving dress. So I'm gonna go get these together, but it is time for Bed Sugar Bear. 
she's trying to put this. Why are you taking the skeleton apart? <laughs> He's got to go in the trash. The season is over. <laughs> but next year, obviously, we'll get a fourth one, which is so crazy. And like I said, we're going to keep our eye out for one for Mr. Hunter this year, too. But <laughs> all right, guys, thanks for watching.